Their story is called Night, Light, Sleep Tight. This is one of Molly's favourite stories. Night, Light, Sleep Tight. Night, Light, Sleep Tight. Jack was trying to fall asleep. He closed one eye and then the other. He put his head under his wing and took it out again. Nothing worked. The night was dark and Jack was scared of the dark. Oh dear, he sighed. Night time is so dark and scary. I wish it was light time. Jack. Yeah. Who did a merry voice? Jack jumped. Who's there? He quacked. It's me, Olivia, said a very small owl. Shouldn't you be asleep? said Jack. Not me, hooted Olivia. My family sleep in the light time. Do you want to play with me? I will in the morning, said Jack, but I'm trying to sleep now. I'll help, said Olivia. I'll sing you to sleep. She hooted a gentle lullaby. Very soon, Jack's eyes began to close and he fell fast asleep. When Jack woke up, it was starting to get light. Hello, whispered Olivia, but she didn't sound cheerful now. What's the matter? quacked Jack. I'm scared, said Olivia. I've never been out in the light time before. Everything looks different and the hot sun is coming. There's no need to be afraid of the sun, said Jack. The sky was turning pink and gold. Oh, said Olivia. It's pretty. Don't look right at the sun. It might hurt your eyes. But it feels nice on your feathers, said Jack, as the sun appeared. It's not too hot after all, said Olivia. And look at the bright colours everywhere. Come on, said Jack. There's lots to see in the light time. Jack led the way up the path and Olivia followed. Suddenly she cried. Oh, oh, something stuck to my feet. What stuck to her feet? Shadow. Look, they're the same colour as their feet. Oh, yeah, true. The beak is the same colour as their feet. Good spotting, Molly. That's your shadow shape, explained Jack. Look, you can make it small like an egg. Or tall. Like a grown-up, giggled Olivia. See how big we are. Let's race. And off they ran, chasing their shadows in the sunshine. I don't know where he should have went with. with he should have woke up with one of the parents. He should have woke up with his parents? Yeah. Oh, true. Maybe she told her parents that she was going to play with her friend Jack, eh? Later on, Jack went swimming. Olivia watched him ducking and bobbing on the pond. She dipped a toe in the water. I wish I could swim, she said. I wish I could climb trees, 
love Jack. How can he turn into that size? Um, what do you mean he's bigger in this picture than in the others? Yeah. I think that's just the way the illustrator has drawn the pictures. Good question. Just then a flock of geese flew overhead. Imagine, whispered Jack, one day, sighed Olivia, we'll be able to fly. Do you know owls can fly? Yeah, owls can fly. So Bigger they fly owls. Up trees. That's right, but not do. little owls can't fly. Maybe the parents have to fly, but Tim in his arms. No, they don't. They teach him to fly, like jump and then fly. Oh. And then flap the wings. True. But Molly's saying maybe until he learns to fly, maybe the parent owls lift the baby owls in their wings. Because how else would they get up the trees, do you think, if they can't fly? Don't dust fly by showing them how to fly. Can bags mm. fly? Can who fly? Bags. Dogs. No, ducks. Ducks, oh. Well, ducks have wings, that way ducks can fly. Yeah, they can. But not baby ducks, they have to learn just like owls. Maybe things. the grown-ups have to live him up. Maybe. Good <laughs> idea. <laughs> How can he stand to it? That's too fake. Mm, that's how owls stand, I think. At last, Olivia yawned. Oh, I'm ready to go to sleep now, she said. A blackbird was singing nearby. Let's join in, said Jack. And they hooted and quacked all the way home. Back at her nest, Olivia started to hop up to bed. How good she Oh, there you go. That's how up. she gets up the tree. She hops up. Hops up the tree. Light, light, she murmured Does sleepily. Does she fly up light, there? Light, light, replied Jack. Does she fly up there? What do you think? Yes. Yes. Well, it says she hopped up to bed. So maybe when she hasn't learned how to fly, she just hops. Light, light, oh. replied Jack. Sleep tight. Raise his arms up together. Because he's cold. All scared when it's good night time. Ah, good thinking. Let's find out, eh? That evening, Jack stayed awake and watched the sunset. Olivia came out of her nest. She scooted down through the branches. Yoo-hoo, she hooted. But Jack looked worried. What's the matter? asked Olivia. How can she fly? I think she's just jumping down.